question two. It's like we have a complex number question here. Um, I'll just copy the diagram rather than the whole thing. Okay. Um, plot and label set one conjugate and the complex the complex on the diagram. Okay, so uh, Z1 would be 3 minus 3i. Its conjugate would be 3 plus 3i, which would be up here. Z2 and Z3 are two other complex numbers. Plot and label Z2 and Z3. Okay, 5 plus i, Z2. And 6 minus 2i, that's Z3. Uh, and then we want to calculate 4 times Z2, which is 5 plus i. Minus 5 times Z3, which is 6 minus 2i. So that will be 20 plus 4i minus 30 plus 10i which is minus 10 plus 14i. And then work out the value of the absolute of Z3. So the absolute of Z3 would be the absolute of six minus two i, or the modulus I should say, which is root six squared plus four squared. So that's root 40, which is two root 10, isn't it? Um, given your answer in third form. The complex numbers four, five, six, and seven are shown in the diagram down below. The diagram is to scale. Tick one box to indicate which of the four has the largest module. Let's give your reason. Um, if my eyes do not deceive me due to the hardness, it looks like said said five is the answer because it is furthest from the origin. Zero, zero point then. Nice.